What's going on everybody? Today we're back with another video here. In a little bit I say that I was trying to make this as short as possible because I thought it was going to be a long video. It turned out to be a long video, so I hope you guys still like it. This is just the top of my fi top 5 favorite of every category including like skins, rack wings, pickaxes, you know, all that. Uh yeah, hope you guys enjoy the video and uh I'll let myself talk. So, let's go on over to number 5 of my top 5 favorite skins I have. Number 5 is gonna go to slumber slumber he's really 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 unique and honestly he's one of my favorite skins by a long shot he's super unique the blue pink and purple that and the yellow that go across right there and his arm is really really cool he's really definitely carried about this edit uh, this edit tower here because I don't really like this one to be, to be honest but this one's really really nice and unique I'm buying it whenever it comes out next by the way uh, coming up next we have none other then journey versus hazard journey versus hazard overall that battle pass itself was easily one of my favorite battle passes of all time super unique everything was really colorful really nice it was one of my favorite seasons of all time i didn't really play much that season because i was grounded for a decent amount of it but you know i still definitely enjoyed everything in that season and i wish i could go back um yeah coming in at number three we have Cloud Striker. Cloud Striker is my sweat skin on this account. She's my main sweat skin. I actually have like two different accounts that have her. Um, my main, my my other account, the one that, the one that you got that I posted first on this channel, ha did not does not have this skin, and that's because I couldn't get I couldn't get my my, my uh, Nintendo Switch account onto the PlayStation to get it during while I had while I had the opportunity to. So I just ended up missing out on getting her, and it really sucks because I really love this skin. To be fair, um, but yeah, let's just let's go right on into number two, and that's Ocean. Ocean is super unique, one of the one of the best color schemes of all Fortnite skins. She's got blue, pink, purple, and then the way they merge the colors into it just looks absolutely outstanding. Her second edit style, which is pink and blue, is really good. This one, which is teal, blue, and purple, is really, really, really good. And even without the mask on, she looks good. So, honestly, I'd give this skin a 10 out of 10 rating for me. I'll give it a 10 out of 10 rating for me. It's easily one of my favorite skins of all time. And I, I, I hope everybody else likes it like I do. Coming in at number one, we have Ripley vs. Sludge. This is obvious. He's my YouTube profile picture. This is obvious that he's my favorite skin, but he is. So... The story behind him. He's adorable. He's my favorite colors, which is blue and teal. The black actually matches, unlike these ones. Like, there's not too much black, like these ones. He's he's thick. He's a, he's adorable. And yeah, that's why I like him so much. A lot of people don't like him, and I can see I can see where they're coming from. He's a big skin. He's very very pay to lose, but he's just so adorable that he just it just surpasses everything for me uh yeah it's going into number five on the backlings we have none other than remis i love this dog he looks like a wolf wolves are my second third favorite animal he, he's adorable he's not like he is like the thing that he's on that he's on is not badly colored like this one i do like this doggo as well but I don't really like the things that are around his neck, like this one. The red doesn't. The red is all right. This one, the pink is just not it. And then this one, the green, it just works well enough, I guess. But Remus, he doesn't have anything around his neck. Also, he has also the thing that he's on matches his color scheme. His his, his third edit style is easily really 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 good. Matches with almost any Frozen series skin in the game. Uh, I don't care for the skull edit style, but these two edit style really here carry him into number five. We got at number four. We have the wolf pack. Wolf pack is super usable. It looks like a plastic katana, and it's usable on literally every skin in the game. It might be very boring and bland that he's on that it's on this list, but it's so usable and customizable that it just has to make it onto the list. Not customizable, but it's but you can basically put it on literally anything, and it will work a hundred percent. Coming in at number three, we have the Cactus Jack. Great backling. Uh, matches with literally anything in the game. Even though it's red, I 
honestly it's one of my favorites in the game also there is a thunderstorm outside so i hope you guys can't hear that but you might be able to so uh yeah cactus jack is an easily one of my favorite backlinks in the game super usable even though travis is it's like it's also one of the rarest backlinks in the game i seen around 800 days ago so and i'm gonna put this at number two as uh, number three as well astro world is just great it's super usable on literally anything the three edit styles it has are really good colors personally i like the blue one the most as you guys already know i could see the definite likeness likeness in the orange and the pink but the but the blue i like i like the theme parks they're one of my favorite things to go to so i love this it's like a little mini world on his back i just i love it Coming in at number two, we have none other than the hollow back. It's super customizable, usable with almost any skin of the game that has a color scheme that has an emoticon. If you have any emoticons and you started back in chapter one, you'll you'll love this backlink too. This backlink is great, super usable on literally everything in the game, and is easily one of the best backlinks you can buy for your buck. Super usable, super customizable, one of the best in the game. Um, and then coming in at number one, actually actually for number two as well we're gonna put season signature as well this backlink is super customizable it has over 10 it has 10 edit styles each of them have a unique color scheme that is able to be used on any skin my favorite being the nana nana the victor's victor visitor's victory and the ice bling but i've seen a lot of other people like the but dub dragon neo future dusty danger and all those other ones but super customizable backlink usable with literally anything I do in fact enjoy that set entirely. I enjoy it quite a bit. Yeah. Coming in at number one, we have the Spectral Spine. Super easy. Super easy to, super easy to find. Comes out every 30 days. Super customizable. Easily one of the best things you can get for your buck. The blue and the red, the blue matches my favorite skin, as you can see, matches him really well. The red can be used on a lot of other things. So and this, there's an edit style in the in the concepts that is pink and yellow. So I, I don't know if that's going to be the next edit style that he gets. But if it is, I wouldn't mind because it would work for, you know, my FNCS skin that I have on my other account. Anyhow, easily my favorite backlink. I use it on almost anything in the game. So I'm going to give this one a solid 10 out of 10. And yeah, let's get right on into pickaxes. I'm trying to make this video go by fast because I've noticed when I did this before, it was like 16 minutes long. So I'm hoping this one won't hit 16 minutes. Coming in at number 5, we have none other than the Icebreaker. Icebreaker is super usable on literally anything in the game. Works well with almost everything. Can go perfect with any skin that you have in your locker, and is easily one of the best things you can buy from your buck. It's only 500 V-Bucks, and it can be used on literally everything, so I think that's pretty good. Coming in at number 4, we have none other than the Reaper Pickaxe. The Reaper Pickaxe is super customized, super usable on literally anything. Works well with literally anything. And the sound isn't bad, actually. I used to hate it, but now I don't hate it nearly as much. And to be fair, it was only 800 V-Bucks, and it comes around every every uh, to October. So if you want a seasonal pickaxe that's not going to be around for about 300 days, then go ahead and buy Reaper, because it doesn't come back to the item shop like a daily item. Uh, coming in at number two, number three, we have the Mauler pickaxe. Super usable on the anything. Demogorgon, one of my main skins, it's completely usable on that works really really well with, with both edit styles this one and this one most people know this one though this is one of the rarest pickaxes in the game in fact it's 1025 days only in the shop five times so it's really rare but hey it's a good pickaxe usable on literally anything in the game i don't even think it's been in chapter one chapter two but it's super good definitely recommend you guys buy it super customizable works well with anything Coming in at number two, we have the autocleave. This is very heavily biased because of the fact that, you know, I like my rare items, and this is a very rare item. Last seen 1,125 days ago, somewhere near that. This still hasn't been updated, so we don't know if this is ever returning. Um, very bad pickaxe, to be fair. I don't like using this with any skin, really, but it's super rare, so I use it. Um, yeah, I give this pickaxe a solid three to four out of 10. But it's rarity carries it up in my liking by a lot. Uh, honorable mention here, a diamond jack. This is another one of my favorite pickaxes, and that's because of how rare it is. This pickaxe is pr 
probably the best silver pickaxe you can find in the game. All the diamonds work really, really well with gray and silver and the red on the top. And it reminds me of, uh, it reminds me of the weekend Starboy. Reminds me of that. Uh, and then another honorable mention is going to be the Crimson Scythe. Lasting 1,285 days ago, this is a bundle pickaxe with the Inferno skin. One of the rarest pickaxes I have in the game, personally. And I think it's really, really cool. The red is perfect to match any red skin. The black just blends in so well with the red. And honestly, I give it a solid 9 out of 10. Super great. I mean, at number one, you guys could obviously tell, it's the Sledgehammer. Uh, this is easily my favorite backling of pickaxe because it's look at that it changes it changes pickaxes it changes from a hammer to a to a stub to a pickaxe to an axe so super customizable super usable and anything I don't have any of the edit styles because I got grounded that season for a lot uh, but there's a purple and red edit style that can be used on practically anything in the game definitely recommend you guys use it if you guys have it because it's a great pickaxe uh, yeah we're gonna go on number five with the gliders. It's gonna be the one shot. The one shot's super usable on literally anything in the game. Works well with any skin, any back, any backlink, any pickaxe. Works well with anything. Use. It's probably one of the most usable pick gliders in the game. It is getting rare now. It's been over a thousand, a hundred days since it's been available. But you know, it's 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 a great glider. Coming in at number four, we have the blue streak. The blue streak is easily my favorite. My favorite of this type of glider I love the pick I love the PlayStation design on it it's one of my rarest gliders and it's super super easy to use on anything I recommend you guys use it if you guys if you guys have it it's one of the greatest gliders for uh, of this style like this type of style of glider it's easily one of the greatest uh, gonna come in at number three we have none other than the umbrella of the last reality this one the rocks and the lightning just make it so great. The rocks, the rocks with the lightning instead of the normal boring staff like that. Also, they took away that that little thing at the top, at the top of the right underneath the umbrella, and they replaced it with even more rocks. Now, there's also a galaxy design on it, on it with sand from season five with rocks from Cube from the Kevin, which was season eight. So season eight, five, and I think that's season three. It's a mix of those three seasons, and it's great. I love it so much. I'd recommend you guys use it if you guys have it. It's amazing. Coming in at number two, we have the holographic. As you guys can see, I do love using myself my, my umbrellas. And this one, it's usable on practically anything. The blue and the different shades of blue and the graph design on it makes it super great and super unique and customizable. It's just one of the best gliders that you can get. Also, it's free. But it was last available over a thousand hundred days ago, so I can see how a lot of people won't have this. Uh, coming in at number one, we have the downpour. I love water. I don't think y'all have realized this, but I love water. I love blue, and that's what this is. This is a blue water glider. Usable on mostly anything that I like. It's one of the greatest gliders, in my opinion, of all time. I would give. I'm giving it a solid not 10 out of 10 rating. This one's a 9 out of 10. This one's a 10 out of 10. This one's a. Th this one's a 9 out of 10. And this one's a seven out of two. So that's my ratings for. Coming in at number five for the for the emotes, we have Fancy Feet. I love Fancy Feet. Fancy Feet's one of my favorite country emotes that they have in this game. I'm pretty sure everybody used to think this was Daquan's emote back when it was back when it was uh, leaked. But then you know Daquan came out and saw it and said, "No, that's not my emote." That's not my and died down in popularity a lot from that. Um, good emote, usable. It's very usable. It's rare too, so that's a plus for it. Uh, yeah, nothing else to say about it. It's a solid seven out of ten emote. Uh, coming in, coming in at number four, four, we have deepened the best summer emote in the game. I don't think they could have gotten better than this. I do wish it was not a challenge emote. It was an, it was an item shop one, so I could get on my other account too. But, you know, whatever. Still a great emote. One of my favorites. 10 out of 10 rating. Next up, at number 3, we have none other, you have none other than Switch Step. Or Switch Step. Here. Switch Step is great. Relax, vibes, chill, laid back. 
It's also really, really rare. It's not like in 880 days or something like that. Super rare, super rare. It's usable on anything, and it's easily my favorite, my favorite rare emote that I have. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10 rating. It's super good. A lot of people want it. I could see why. It's great, but the music back switch up. Listen to it, by the way. It's great. Coming in at number two, we have introducing. No, overdrive. Oh, introducing is number one. Overdrive. The beginning, the, the entire emo until the second second bit round of it is just great. I love it. Super, super good. Like the beat, the the bass up. Like when it starts to grow up. This part right here, I don't really like as much. But the beginning part of it is just absolutely outstanding. One of my favorite emotes of all time. It's easily a top 10 emote of all time. Uh, coming in at number one, we have introducing. I love this emote. I, don't, I can't say much. I can't say enough about this emote. This emote's great. It's exclusive to PlayStation only, so not many people have it. But it's super good. The beat is great. The music is great. The dance is unique. And that's, in fact, it's what it's complicated was was based off of was introducing. This was the item shop variation of introducing. They did so much worse than introducing because introducing is god tier. Easily my number three favorite emote of all time. Uh, yeah, I, my number two favorite emote of all time is Jitterbug. I have it on this account, but I'm not gonna put it on this video because it's on my other video. Uh, and then my number one favorite emote of all time is probably Scenario. Scenario is great. Look it up on YouTube. It's great. Uh, okay, number five for the wraps. I'm trying to make this video as fast as possible. Number five for the wraps is Polished Stone. This is literally a water wrap. It's water. It's literally one of my favorite things ever. Uh, yeah, I don't get what they were t what they named it for, for stone. It's clearly not stone. It's clearly water. Maybe just stone in the back and then water over top of it. I don't know. So I call it the water wrap, as a lot of other people do. Coming in at number four, we have none other than the cloudburst. I love storms. I love rain. I love thunder. I love lightning. So it, it's this 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 fat this mitts uh, no. This matches me so well that I just love it. It fits my personality, it fits what I like. Super good rap. Coming in at number three, we have the Boogeyman. The Boogeyman is super usable on literally anything in the game. Super clean, super sleek. It's also a very rare rap. I think it's getting very rare. It's been like over a thousand days since it's been available. So a lot of people are using the stealth black gun rap like I have on my other accounts. It's still a top 10 it's still a top 10 rap of all time super unique super customizable and it's very very good for blending it honorable mention here is going to go to burn mark burn mark is easily one of my rarest gun wrap that i have last seen a thousand two hundred days ago this was a part of the inferno set and the inferno challenges so it's super rare not many people have this one but I do, and it's quite rare, and it's a good orange gun wrap for you guys who have it. And then another honorable mention is going to go to Goosebumps. Again, a rare wrap, last seen around 800 days ago, only the shop six times. A lot of people bought the skins and the emos, but nobody really bought the wrap. I don't really see the wrap or the pickaxe very often. And I find it quite sad, because they're both quite good. This is literally Astrojack as a wrap, by the way. So it's really good, and I recommend you guys use it if you guys have it. And the final falling, the final honorable mention is falling leaf. Super good wrap. The orange matches super well. The leaves aren't a bad contrast to it. I like the background. I like the leaves. I like the overall design. I like the overall feeling of Thanksgiving from this. It's overall a great wrap. I'm gonna give it a nine out of ten rating for me. Coming in at number two, we have the undercurrent. This is my favorite wrap by a long shot. Well, one of my favorite wraps by a long shot. I love the. I love the, the sign on the end, it reminds me of my favorite trap in Save the World, which is the falling trap, the tire trap, that, the designs of it remind, just remind, like, I don't know how to explain it, but I love the designs of, the, of that trap, and that, that yellow, yellow warning symbol, and the yellow at the end reminds me of it as well. I also played a map in Minecraft back before I used to play Fort, back, uh, back when I was on my Fortnite, you know, not playing it much, uh, and that was one of my favorite maps of all time it was an undersea undersea exploring fortnite app 
and there was like there's like fish, there's whales, there's a whole ass map that was humongous, and I'm betting it took forever to build that, but you know, it was a great map. I loved it so much. I highly recommend you guys go play it. If I can if I can find the name of it, I will put it in the video right here. And yeah, I recommend you guys go play that rap. I do also love the water at the end of it, at the beginning of it, like of the of the, the gun rap. It's easily one of my favorite raps. Uh, coming in at number one, as you guys already know, Ripley. Super usable on anything in the game. The black adds a good touch into the blues. And I love the, you know, Ripley's my favorite skin, so this matches any skin I run. I actually, this is my main rap. If you guys see here, I don't change my, my rap. Ripley is my main rap. These two are for sweat combos, so they have black. But as you can see, for most of my combos, I don't change my rap. Um, yeah, Ripley's been my main rap since since I since I got the rap, and it's easily my favorite rap in the game by a long shot. Yeah, I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna go really fast over my music packs. My favorite music packs are Limitless, OG Classic, Spies. Solid Groove, Coral Chorus, and Turn Up. I don't have Turn Up, but it's they're still my favorite raps. As you guys can see, I have a lot of raps. I don't have any archived, even though I definitely should archive some of these. Actually, I'm gonna do that right now. Uh, but yeah, almost all of my music packs I actually do enjoy quite thoroughly. So if you know the ones that I'm that I'm archiving here, I don't enjoy these raps. So yeah, I hope you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, leave a like and subscribe so we can hit 100 subscribers. And yeah, thank you guys for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed and love you guys. Peace out.